NBC6 reporter Derek Lewis is live now at Jackson Memorial Hospital with more on that effort. Derek. Alina, as hospitals like this one here behind me continue helping patients with COVID-19, other people are looking for financial help or even food drives to help feed their families. More than 11 months into the pandemic, South Floridians are still lined up at food drives. This pandemic has really just been kind of hard. Brittany Oriole is one of many families who has stopped by Unity on the Bay Church today to pick up eggs, milk, and other foods. I'm a single mom. I'm out here alone. And having something like farm share to be able to just drive through and pick up food, you know, when your hours have basically been cut in half, it's really just a big help. The church partnered with FarmShare Saturday to feed 400 families, families that have had a tough year and continue looking for help. You can't expect just because your situation is one thing for my situation to be the same and me able to be able to get back on my feet just, you know, doesn't work like that, unfortunately. It's not over, and we realize as a spiritual community that there are people that are still hurting. Juan Deliero is an associate minister at Unity on the Bay. He says knowing the pandemic is not over, he feels is his responsibility to help. It's an expression of one of our core values at Unity on the Bay, which is generosity. You know, we really feel that we are the ways in which God is able to support and love on other people. And so it's, it's really a responsibility of us living our principles and living our values. Brittany appreciates the community not forgetting about people like her during a time when help is needed the most. This really is a huge blessing for people. And some people just think it's all oh, free food. No, this is the difference between making sure that my daughter has breakfast in the morning or not. The church tells me they will continue helping families for months to come. Live in Miami, I'm Derek